now we are going to start our session. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Say Namaste, please. Hello and good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Hello and good morning. We are from Bangladesh. We are the students of Everos International School. This school was established in the year 2014. This school has three branches and we are speaking from the main branch. Today we are expecting to have a lively conversation with you. Today our conversation will include three sessions. The first of which is a presentation that was done by the students of grade 5 and 6. After that we will have a free talk in which you will have four students available for you to ask questions. The students will discuss the answers. At last, we will have a video performance of a role play that was done by the students of grade 5 and 6. Now, to start off, I would like to invite Lubaba Kutsu and Raisa Mosana to give the presentation. Now, we will share the screen with you so you can see the presentation. Okay, but now we are sharing our screen so that you can see the presentation of our students. I am Raisa Musanath from Standard 5. Okay, now, what is disability? Disability refers to the person who is physically, psychologically and mentally not functioning properly due to the social barriers. <laughs> rights of the people with disability. The United Nations Convention on the Rights of People with Disability, CRPD, adopted in 2006, aim to promote, protect, and ensure the full and equal enjoyment of all human rights and fundamental freedoms by all the persons with disability and to promote respect for their inherent dignity. Social awareness about disability. We have to educate you come here and speak. Yeah. They'll be able to listen to you. That's nice. Social awareness about disability. We have to educate people, create awareness. This will, in general, ensure that the people do not mock at the doors, transgender, or any other differently abled people. Rather, this will help the. Uh, rather, this will help them to break the social barriers, and people can reach the disabled one and stand beside them. Statistics of global disability. One billion people, or 15% of the world's population, has experienced some form of disability, and disability prevalence is higher for developing countries. One-fifth of the estimated global total, or between 110 million or 190 million people, has experienced significant disability. Thank you. And now, I would like to call Lubaba to continue with our presentation. Hello, good morning. I'm Lubaba Kulsum from Standard 6. Thank you, Raisa, for the speech. Now, what is our roles and responsibilities towards the people with disabilities? Some institution for disabled people. School for gifted children, Blessing Child Special School, Proyash Institution for Special Education. Rights of people in rights of people with disabilities in Bangladesh. The Parliament members and the President of Bangladesh passed the People with Disabilities Lovely. Rights and Protection Act on 9th October 2013. Now you might be wondering what does rights mean? According to the Constitution of Bangladesh, rights mean all the citizens of the country have the rights to enjoy their dignity, fundamental human rights, and have social equality. Establishment of rights. The government needs to focus and ensure the following privileges. Friendly roads for proper mobility, facilitate good working environment, more institutions should be built where all sorts of differently able people can be trained according to their caliber. Responsibilities of the concerned authorities. All the government, non-government. Now. Now I'd like to continue with my presentation. Responsibilities of the concerned authorities. All the government, non-government organization, local, and educational authorities will have the rights to make new laws. 
instead of existing government laws, to establish the rights of the people with disabilities. Responsibilities our school has taken for the disabled students. The students who are suffering from autism, our school ensures to a trained teacher who can handle them. For the students who are limped, our school provides elevators. Our school also has sisters who can help them. In future, our school will provide more facilities for other forms of disabled students. People can be disabled, but that doesn't mean that they are not aiming for their dreams. Here are some names of some disabled people who are successful. Bhaskar Bhattu National Consult to the Access of Information, Bangladesh Government, Founder YPSA, works at SWAC. Noor Nahyan, another example of disabled people who are successful. He's the vice captain of the Bangladesh Wheelchair Cricket Team, former sports club president, education from East West University. <laughs> He's a student of computer and technology. He's also a poet and a writer. We're almost at the end of our presentation. Stephen Hawkins once said, disabilities need not be an obstacle to success. Thank you for, for listening to our speech. Thank you for listening to our speech. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, we are moving to our next session. Thank you, fellows. Now, I would like to request you to take part in a free talk with some of our students. In this part, you will ask questions to our students and they will discuss the answers. Now, the students that are available for this free talk are Aisha Amir from grade 5, we have, uh, we have Lamia from grade 5, then we have Irma from grade 6, and Tashkia from grade 6. Yes, can you see our students? Four students uh, standing in front of the camera? Yeah. Okay. Okay, in this session, they are going to talk with your students. They have questions to ask from your students. Your students also can ask them. Let's have a free talk here. Yes? Yeah. I are there any disabled students in your school? Yes, we have in junior sections. We have in elementary sections, uh, but we don't have in our... Do you have anything to ask? How do you have them? How do you have them? We are not in the same building. They are in another building. The teachers are helping, the sisters and others. Their friends are helping, but we are in another building. Yes, of course. How do you react when you see... Uh, uh, any disabled people? Uh, we try to help them actually because uh, inspiration from them. About 15 person. Yeah, how, uh, what do you do for your disability in your country? What help you? Yes, our government is taking steps about disabled people. Our government is providing many facilities like our government is providing some road facilities, like there is slide slopes in one side of the road for the people who can't walk. And there is traffic police for the people who is blind for helping them to cross the road. And there is so many facilities like that. What your country, what about your government? What are what a step are they or have they taken for the disabled people?
So I would like you to watch it. Can I play it? Okay. Uh, we are sharing our screen. Please have a look. We are sharing our screen to show you the drama our students have prepared. It is prepared by standard seven and standard five and six. السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته. Everyone, please sit down. How are my little angels today? Why do our teacher always gives special attention to those kids? I don't know, but it really bothers me. Today we are all going to be learning about tenses. Tenses is something that we are doing, we have done, or we will do. There are three classifications of tenses. The first of classification is past tense. Past tense, mean, past tense means something that we have done previously. Understood? The second one is present tense. Present tense is something that we are doing at the moment or currently. The last one that we are going to learn is called future tense. Future tense is something that we are going to do in the future. Everyone understood? Yes. Can everyone write these in your copies, please? Yes? Can you repeat the last tense for me? The last tense is called future tense. It is something that we are planning on doing in the future. Understood? Okay. Yes, Yash, you want to say something? Sir, what are we waiting for? We all have finished writing. I'm waiting for Mudassir and Tampi to finish. Sir, why are we waiting for them? Every teacher delays their lesson, but you give more attention to them, but not us. Listen, Yash, it's not their fault that they can't see or hear properly. Allah made them as they are. Now, I don't want to explain how, why Allah made them like this, but I want to say that they are a part of us. Now we can't go forward for getting them and leaving them behind. Instead, we should go forward with the helping mentality towards them. Yes, Mohamed, you want to say something too? But sir, it's too much. Well, if you can put yourself in their shoes, then you will feel them. Okay, let's see. Alright, alright, we'll see. Mahmud, uh, can you bring me a set of headphones, a blurred spectacle and some bandages please? Yes, sir. Thank you, Mahmoud. Yes, Mahmoud. Uh, can you please put them on? On them. Thank you. Just let's carry on with the class, shall we? So now we are going to learn sentences with each one of these tense. Okay, understood? The first sentence with past tense is I ate dinner. Everyone understood? The second sentence is with the present tense. Hey, why me? Sir told you not to take it off. The second sentence is with present tense. The sentence with it is, I eat dinner. Understood everyone? And the last sentence, which is with future tense, is called, I will eat dinner. Everyone understood? Can everyone please copy these in your notebooks? Yes, Mohamed. Sir, I couldn't hear you properly. It seems to me it's impossible to continue with this. Okay. Talha, how do you feel? Sir, I realize the suffering for not seeing properly. For me, it seems to me that I can't live my life. Okay. Yes, sir. Sure. We really feel sorry for them. You are right. They need our help. We really should help them. Everyone sit down. 
Yes, you are right, Yash. We really must feel sorry for them. We must feel the pain and suffering that they have been going through for years after years. You guys couldn't bear that for only a few minutes. Can you even imagine the situation that they are in? So here we have all the members that were in the cast. So we have the co-teacher as Mahmoud. Then we have we have a student that is sitting in the front desk, Tamhir. Then we have a student Kwan who was behind wearing yeah. headphones. Then we have Binyamin who was wearing the ear. Yeah, then we have Taja Muntasi who was wearing the glasses. At this side we have Niamur who was the student beside Mohail. And at that side we have Yash, the student that was sitting at the last bench. And on that side we have Muntasir and behind them we have Abra. Abra, Abra. We'd be able to watch it on YouTube. The drama that was played for our students. How are you so it's actually very nice that students enjoyed it. Thank you so much. <laughs> International School.